One day I asked him, what is Star Wars? He goes, you don't know what Star Wars is, Mama? Then you're not an American. He always saw himself as any other American. Salman Hamdani played high school football in Queens, later majored in chemistry, and like so many college students, couldn't quite decide what career to choose. I told him, you know, focus on one thing, you know. There are so many memories Talat Hamdani shares about her son. But when asked about her son's death, she's hesitant. They confirmed that indeed his remains were found, his lower body in 34 pieces. And they give us his genes. She lost her son on September 11th. He was an NYPD cadet and EMT. At first, Salman was even briefly considered a suspect because of his Pakistani background. His name was later cleared. And as painful as it is for her to talk about, she says she must talk, especially now with the controversy surrounding the Islamic Center proposed near Ground Zero. In all honesty, I'm not fighting for a mosque. I'm fighting for my rights. Her religion is now the issue that divides her from many of the other 9-11 families. She says she understands the sensitivity behind the location, but she's also quick to remind people not all Muslims are terrorists. They say they're doing it, you know, in the name of Islam. Doesn't mean the rest of the Muslim world should be painted with a broad brush as being, you know, terrorist. Nowadays, Talath paints. She finds it therapeutic. She's attempting to get other Muslim 9-11 families to come forward, but the issue has hit such a nerve, she doubts many will speak out. But for her part, she plans to keep fighting. In New York, Bonnie Ghosh, The Associated Press.